have with us Professor Kelly Morse, uh, who teaches at Old Dominion University in the English department. Listening to the students, I notice I get a lot less questions and emails, late night emails from students when they're because they're actually interacting with the critic team instead of sending me emails that I'm never going to you know, I'm not gonna look at my emails at 11.30 at night, but somebody a critic is gonna be helping them on if they're trying to navigate through an assignment. So I think that is just something to know. It looks like a lot, but it's actually quite easy to move through and it's easy for students to move through and it's easy to start, you can start pretty simple and then build up over time. I've tried some other systems and I haven't seen anything that has the support that critic has, especially the pre-meetings that really force you to think about your outcomes and really get you into a successful place from the beginning. I'm not having to create models at this point because the students themselves are doing all the work. Um, and that is really freeing for me. And again, I'm not clicking on like 50,000 different things. I'm just going into Critic. I'm just looking at an individual assignment. It just pops up. And so I'm really able to step back which gives them more freedom. I think they feel safer with each other and it, it just gets me out of that like student teacher where I'm the only audience. And so they're like, whatever, I'm just doing this for a grade. And then it redirects them towards their peers. And then I get to facilitate and work on, help them with their skills. So it's a really, really different interaction and it's great, it's so nice to show them like other, here's people who are doing it here you're doing well, even though it's anonymous, that student knows who they are, that that's their review, and that makes them want to strive harder. So yeah, it creates this positive atmosphere where they really want to look after each other. When you've got three or four students who are saying the same things, what's working well, what's not working well, it becomes really clear to the student. Um, and since it's, since it's anonymous, it feels like the students um, in a funny way, there's more judgment, but in a good way, like their first drafts are so much better than anything they ever turned into me when it was just coming into me. Their first drafts are so much better because they know other people are going to look at them. Giving critique to others is an incredibly important skill. And like what you're doing is you are actually, you are practicing showing and modeling what professional critique looks like to maybe an 18 year old student who's never seen this before. One of the things that's really great about Critic is it randomly assigns different students to each other. I don't have to do that anymore. Thank God. And um, certain students as Critic sees in the algorithm, as they're closer on the calibration and as their peers say that was a great critique and if I like spotlight it, they start getting little stars and those um, stronger peers, their scores are worth more and they get moved across all the different students over the course of the semester, which is amazing. And then the weaker students get chances like their scores weight less and the weaker in peer assessment and they also get moved around. So I don't worry too much.